Hi there, welcome to Tech Ops World. This is Vijay Silvam. In this video, we are going to see how to configure Jest and remove Karmo Jasmine in our Angular project and we'll do the unit test case coverage. And in our upcoming videos, we will see how to create a chatbot app completely from the scratch and this application was one of my coding challenge for a job in Germany. And we'll see how to create a sign up, login, logout, chatting with multiple people, WebSocket without any third party packages in this app. We will also see how to 100% document this application and build architecture diagram and completely unit test cases coverage for this project with Jest. And finally, we will see how to dockerize this application and how to deploy our Angular application and Node.js apps in different free cloud environment, example Heroku, AWS. I will also share the solution for unknown things I have faced during my full stack coding development, UI, UX, mobile and especially lots of videos on Angular. Now here comes the most interesting part. Do you want to land into your dream job in any parts of the world? Be it Germany, Switzerland, Australia, UAE or anywhere and wanted to earn 4 times, 5 times of your salary or even more? Okay, I will share all the experience I had to land into my dream job and also I will create a series of videos on creating the most wanted and powerful resume where it is liked by many CEOs, HRs all over the world. Do you want to see the response I got from them? You are welcome. Please take a look. And the favors all I wanted from you is please do subscribe our channel for all the interesting upcoming videos and hit the bell icon for instant notification. And also if you like the video or you got any information which you are looking for or anything new, please like the video and comment your thoughts and share it to your friends and it means a lot to me. Okay, now I understand it's a lot in the intro. Now let's quickly jump into the just unit testing. Let's first create an Angular project. I have used Visual Studio Code Editor, you can use anything. So I am creating the Angular project. Angular Jest. Okay, so we will be doing all the 10 steps. We will remove Karma Jasmine from the code and also uh, set up Jest. And also finally we will create a test case and run those test cases. And we will also see the test coverage. Okay, our project has been created. As a first step, we will uninstall all the Karma Jasmine. Okay. Let me open package.json file. Okay, we have the package.json. I'll keep, uh, I will keep the just configuration steps aside. As a first step, we will uninstall all the packages related to Karma Jasmine. Uh, first, let me navigate into the folder. Okay, so now we will uninstall all the packages. npm uninstall. Then all the packages, mention all the packages. Okay, so here I am uninstalling only the packages I have, but in your case, you might be having multiple packages. So all the packages which mentions Karma and Jasmine, uh, remove all those packages. Okay. 
okay our step one has been completed we have removed the karma jasmine packages from the dev dependencies okay so the next step is to remove the test object from the angular.json file let's go to the angular.json file go till the end I will have a test object I remove remove this completely and save it and the next step is to delete the karma.conf.js file and the test.ts file so we have the karma.conf.js here we will delete this and the test file will be in the source folder delete this too okay we have completed the three steps and the next step is to install just npm install just other types slash just and just preset angular so this will install just into this application okay we have uh, just has been installed let's create a setup.just.ts file inside the source folder here if you have seen in the internet the setup.just.ts file name will be different it would be in the camel case format but it's better to follow the lower case as our application is completely in the lower case it's a standard to follow here in the setup.just.ts file we will import a just preset angular import okay our uh, step 5 has been completed the next step is to update the tsconfig.spec.json file so here in this file in the types remove the jasmine and instead add gist and also add node and if you see here in the files it is referring the test.ts file which we have deleted change it to setup just.ts file now save it our step 6 has been completed the next step is to add the just configuration in the package.json file so go to the end of the package.json file add the configuration here i have my configuration already written let me paste that yes here i am using the preset just preset angular and i am referring the setup just.ts file and also i am ignoring a few uh, folders that uh, node modules and a disk folder which we don't want to test and here we are uh, uh, referring the spec file save this file and then uh, the next step is to add scripts in the package.json to run our uh, test cases here remove the ng test instead add just and also to watch the test cases in watch mode type test colon watch then just watch this will be helpful for the watch mode and the next one is to show the coverage so test colon coverage here just iphone iphone coverage this will generate a coverage report for us both in command line as well as the uh, uh, html folder save it okay we have completed eight steps so the ninth step is to create test cases we have one component app component for this app component we will uh, do the test cases here if you see the title as angular just we'll check whether this title is angular just or anything else let's go to the spec dot file here we will remove all the codes uh, written for karma jasmine and we will write our own codes
so let's create a fixture and the name of the component and let us create an instance for that okay we have our uh, fixture ready let's create the test case now so now we are going to test whether uh, this let's test the title has angular gist should have a title angular gist So here we will expect the fixture has the title variable and it is equal to the angular gist. Let's save it. Let's check before that. Is it the same? Okay, let us copy here from Okay. Okay, so this is the title. Now, our next step is to run this test case and check the coverage report. Let us run this test case first. npm run test. This will execute our script written in the package.json. So this will execute this line and it will call gist. Here if you see, it is calling gist. Okay, our uh, just case has been passed. Now let us run our uh, coverage. npm run test colon coverage. This will execute just coverage and that will generate a coverage report for us. We got our command line report. So here it shows we have 100% coverage for the statements, branch, functions, and lines. Now we will see it in the Chrome browser. Here we have the coverage folder generated. We'll open it. Now let us open this index.html file. So before that, we will reveal it in an explorer. So here we have, let me open this index.html. Yeah, so here I could see the coverage. So this is uh, completely covered on X for all the lines. If you have learned something new from this video, please do subscribe us. This will motivate me to put more content. And if you have any queries or doubts related to this video and wanted to learn anything specific topic, please comment in the below comment box. I will make a video on it. Until then, signing off Vijay Selvam. See you on next video.